Hiya, uh, in this video I will be showing you how to do pump stacks. I've got one working here, got one here. I built a lot um, before this, but I've left one space open so that I can show you how to build it. Um, first thing you need, or well, th first three things you need for a pump stack are a corkscrew, a wooden pike, pipe, and a um, blocks. So here you can get a wooden corkscrew, uh, pipe section, and you can get blocks here as well. Uh, you can also build the corkscrew and pipe at a glass furnace and a magma and a forge, um, and you can build blocks at a mason's thing. Now I've already done that, so I've got my ingredient. So we'll go up and go down to where my last pump stack needs to be built. Um, now the reason why I've got this carved out here, um, what I'm going to do is up above I've got this pump stack. Now the way pump stacks work is that it takes a, a liquid, let's say, in this case water, but it can also work with magma if this is a magma safe uh, pump stack. It takes this from this level, which is this level, up to this level. Um, now this is a little bit different since this level is a hole so and I've built a wall so that instead of kind of um, staying at this level it's just gonna drop down here then down here down here and then fill up this area right here um, and so uh, why this is good is I'll show you on this pump stack I've got here I'm pumping water through this tunnel down here down through this tunnel through that little tunnel into this area right here and I've got a floodgate here closing it off and a pressure plate which um, closes off at six and this is where the water from my well comes from which is right here um, kinda convenient so that you can control where the water comes in and pump a bunch in and not have to worry about it plus it's fresh water and it's indoor so that's why it's useful um, so I'm going to build my pump workshop so B capital M for machine or screw pump screw pumps um, and then this is how you build it uh, this is important here where it's pumping from and this changes the orientation so you want where it's pumping from the direction to be where the liquid is. So in this case, the liquid, the water, will be here. So I want it pumping from the north. So I agree with this, but if, let's say, I w up here, where the hole is there, then you press M for south, and if the hole was he here, east, west, UMKH, that's pretty simple. So I'll play it down. And there's the blocks, the corkscrew, and the pipe section. Now a dwarf with architecture will run off and do it, uh, set up the um, screw pump, and then a dwarf with <clears throat> carpentry will fill it up. Now the thing is, is that uh, I kind of made a mistake uh, by having this space open. Um, if this were to pump, the water would be here at this level, and so it would leak there and then back into here and back on the door who's pumping who pumps right there so I'm gonna build walls to cover that up um, oh. not on that one yet and that'll all work um, now once you have it built you press Q and then it says enter to start pump manually and that's what I want to do and so my pump a pump operator a dwarf with a pump operating um, job will come and pump it um, pump operating uh, and you see he's taking the water from here down into this down here and it's starting to fill this area up. Um, 
and it goes really quickly. Uh, pump operating is incredibly quick, which is quite convenient. So it's at about five, and I'll tell him to stop. Stop pumping it, and you'll stop. And, or she, actually. And this one is built, so I'll put a wall there. Um, well, it's almost built. And then now, what my contraptions here are, is I'm going to pump water back up into this little lake thing I've got built. Um, and I'll show you how that works. Um, now, I don't have any walls here, so this might be all messy. But the point is is that I'm pumping uh, uh, water up. Now, the thing that's key about this is that the water will end up here, and the hole is here. So I'll... Now, and it's best to see this probably in action. Well, I can't you can't see it in action until this mason comes over here. And so it's done. Okay. Q A enter to start pumping manually. And a dwarf with the pump operating thing will come and do it. Uh, I'll show you where the pump operating thing is. So V uh, PL, it's an engineering pump operating. Uh, so there you go. So he's pumping it into that space right there. Uh, but he's done. So stop. And we'll do it on the next one. Um, and he'll run up and pump the next one. So now he's taken the water that was here and pushed it up to here. And we're just going to keep doing that up until the top. So taking the water from there, pumped it there, and finally taking the water here and pumping it there. Come on. Oh, here's another door. Oh, there he goes. And now all the water's in there. Now, to keep it a cohesive machine, you'd have five dwarfs with pump operating to do it, um, to pump the water up. Uh, there, that's manual pump operating. There's a way to do it with uh, mechanical pump operating. Uh, hence here, total power, power needed. You can hook it up to a water wheel or a windmill. But that's a bit more complicated. I uh, hope this video was instructional.